So y'all see I'm in my bed, right? <laughs> it's like 11, 18 at night and I have to get up at 530 in the morning, right? I'm trying, okay? I am trying. All right. <laughs> Because I said, something's got to give with 2022. Uh, but to touch bases on part one of my little family video, this is going to be part two. Um, I really don't have that much to say in terms of the family. But where I left off was I was saying, don't be afraid of being by yourself. Okay? Because... I feel like a lot of the times, even in relationships, people tend to get into toxic ass relationships just because they fear being by themselves. Like they're older and it's like by yourself, if you're by yourself, like the world is going to end, like there's a no chance for you. I'm not that way because I feel like when you are by yourself, it is basically God telling you that you need to work on yourself. And if you work on yourself and you do what you're supposed to do, God will bring you somebody, you know? And then you just sit on your little throne because you know you are either king or a queen. And you just sit on your throne and you decide if that person is worthy or not. So, um, yeah, don't be afraid of being alone. I love to be alone. Okay. I love peace. I love the quiet. I love to work on my success. I create a vision board. I plan out where the hell I want to be in the next five years. That's actually how I became so successful was because I started to love being alone because all that energy where I could be putting onto somebody else, I end up putting it on myself. And I was like, now it's like my perception of a relationship has changed. Because before I used to be like, oh, I want to get married. Oh, I want to be in a relationship. And now I kind of look at a, a relationship as a sacrifice to my success because that's energy that I'm going to have to be putting into something else. So um, if I get into a relationship, you got to check all my boxes. Okay. You, it, it's I, it's a it's a shame to my future person because I've been through a lot of stuff and my next person they have to check all my boxes and if you don't check all my boxes you ain't gonna get no damn chance I'm just gonna keep working on my damn success and I was like I, I'm proud that you know that is how I view things because it 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 just allows me to live the way that I always visioned me living. And I was actually putting myself on hold for other people. I was not progressing in my life and I was not elevating in my life because I was waiting for people to catch the hell on up. But then it came to a point where I was like, you know what? These people are stuck where they are at and they are content where they are at. I'm not content where I am at. So when it comes to that point, you need to change your circle of friends, okay? Your circle of friends, the relationship, gotta change in the relationship. Something needs to change because you need to elevate and you need to grow. Do not let any kind of obstacle or a path or whatever stop you from progressing and stop you from your goals and stop you from doing what you always wanted to do. And know that it does not matter how old you are. If you have a goal in mind or you have something that you always wanted to do, do it while you can before you get to be so old where you literally can't do it. And then the only thing that you have to do is look back on your life and be like, oh, I wish I would have did this. I wish I would have done that. I'm not an I wish person. I'm an I can and I do person. Okay. That's the type of person that you need to be. But at the same time, I'm an Aries, so I'm kind of like a leader, <laughs> not a follower. Um, but yeah, and uh, just be you, be genuine, be transparent, and be authentic. Because another thing that I can't stand is fake-ass people. I kicked a lot of fake people out of my life, okay? If you there talking and saying all of this stuff, but yet you go and you do other stuff, or you cannot be trusted that is the quickest way for me to kick your ass out of my life, okay? And it's like, as time went on, 
I just I started becoming better at it. Okay. You know, when they say it's lonely at the top, they say that and they, it, for a reason, you know, it's very true. When you are getting um, really successful, you will notice that you start losing people left and right. People that you thought was your friends, you start kicking them out your life. You start losing them and, and cutting them off and stuff. And that's actually a good thing because a lot of the times, those people are not supposed to enjoy your level of success. God gave you your level of success for a reason, and it is yours. And it's not supposed. Sometimes it's not supposed to be shared. No matter how much emotion you have and how much feelings you have, sometimes it's not supposed to be shared with another person. Sometimes it's just specifically for you. Okay, so um, here. I need you guys to start praying. I need you guys to accept God, your your God, whoever that may be, and um, just keep praying and just be happy when you wake up every morning and appreciate, you know, the days that you wake up um, because life is short. It is really short. And um, every every moment that you are on this earth, Try to live your purpose. And if you don't know what your purpose is, I need you to read your Bible and I need you to look at your life and think about what your purpose is. And when you come up with what you think that purpose is, try to do something for that purpose every single day. Like, I feel like my purpose is to bring joy, peace and happiness um, to, to anybody, like somebody in the world. So I try to do that every single day. I try to always make somebody laugh or somebody smile or just to bring happiness, just to make somebody cheer up for that day because you really don't know, you know, what certain people are going through. You don't know what everybody's going through. So I always try to bring joy and happiness and peace. And um, yeah, that, cause I feel like that's my purpose, but yeah. Um, I love you guys. What's today? Thursday. As you can see, I have not got my camera stuff yet, but when I tell you I am working, I am working. Like, I am not, I cannot stress enough how hard I am working because, you know, I'm supposed to get promoted soon. So, I'm trying to check all my boxes to make sure that I can get promoted when I'm supposed to get promoted. So, I am working, all right? But um, sometime this month, I am going to get a camera. Um, it's probably just going to be a cheap camera because, you know, we're going to start from A and work our way up to Z. <laughs> so it's probably just going to be a cheap camera, but it's going to be better than the phone that I'm using now. And I'm going to be able to record um, longer videos and I'm going to be, I need editing software too. So if you guys uh, know of any editing software that you would recommend, because I know of any, and I also, or I know of none, I should say. And I also want to get um, GarageBand and dabble in that. That's the only like type of music software that I know. So if you guys know something that is like uh, different than GarageBand or... You can recommend something to me to buy and try. I will um try it so that way I can make my own um make my own beats, make produce my own uh music beats and things like that because I do want to go into music because I do write um songs like all the time and I be thinking about beats, but I need to put my thoughts into reality. So I was like, I think that that will be a nice hobby for me. So that's what I'm going to be trying to do. But um, yeah, and I'm also going to be, uh, when I get the camera, <laughs> I'm also going to be um, doing like uh, game uploads with commentary and stuff because I've been playing this Call of Duty Vanguard and a lot of people have been complaining about the zombies, but I actually like, you know, I actually like playing um, Call of Duty zombies. Uh, so I'm going to put some uh, video of that I do not like to play in the multiplayer because it be just I be getting so mad but <laughs> but I'm gonna start uploading some videos of that and I might get Far Cry 6 and upload some videos of that but uh yeah I love you guys uh deuces and uh bye bye I'm gonna go brush my teeth and wash my face although my skin is already glowing i think it's the lighting though okay i think it's the lighting but yeah i'm gonna go brush my little face with my little micro abrasion brush i use dermalogica on my face go to uh what is that store alta and look up um dermalogica it's really good for your um your skin 
But uh, yeah, love you guys. Deuces and bye bye. I got to go night night. Love y'all.